lovelies, my name is Emily and this is my channel Painful Hilarity and today I'm going to be doing an Ipsy unbagging, I was going to call it unboxing but it's a bag so it's very confusing to me. Um, Bella's making a cave behind me if you're wondering what that is, that's a Bella head. Uh, it seems like this, I don't know if it's just me but it seems like the packaging was like way shinier this month. I don't know. Um, but maybe, it, I don't know, it just seemed like very brilliant. Okay. On to the non, maybe just being weird stuff. Okay, so you get a little card in here with, I don't like this girl. I, I have, I watch her and stuff, but she just has such weird style. And not weird in like a unique cool way but I guess a lot of people like her so I shouldn't say that but I think they all look so pretty in this like I think they all look so great but it's fresh start by ipsy let's get fresh oh I um just wanted to let you know that for some reason this month it sent me a thing to review my um, products that I got before I actually got my package so I actually got a sneak peek, not like the sneak peek glam thing because I avoid that, but like on my Ipsy account it had all of my things to review. So I don't know why it did that. Um, but this is the bag. It's white on this side and blue on this side and it has a like coral colored. So I know exactly who I'm sending this to. Um, it's like such my best friend Lindsay's colors. So. This is going straight to her. Okay, so first thing I have on here, oh, it has Bipsters 25% off, use coupon code LINER25 off at checkout. So if you wanna do that, I'm guessing this is a liner. Okay, liquid liner jet coastal scents. Let's take a look. If I can get open, yeah. Oh, this is really nice. This is a nice size. Like, to me, this is a full size because I just don't use that much liner. Um, I want to see what the tip is like. Give it to me. Oh, okay. I've never used a tip like this. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I like that. I'm not to like, you know, practice and learn how to use that tip like that, but I really like that. It's a nice crisp line. Oh, I should tell you what it is. It's like a felt liner type tip that you dip into this, which is kind of nice. So it kind of just felt like using a Sharpie, which is kind of nice, but it has a nice thin comes to a nice thin point. Why don't I just show it to you instead of my weird explanations of things? See? It's not too thin at the tip. I guess you can't really see. Yeah. So, I'm really excited about that one. Um, I'm trying to see how what the finish of it is because it just says it's in jet. I don't know if it's like matte or shiny or gloss or so I'm gonna let it dry while I'm looking at other things okay the next thing I pull out is by hey honey and it's take it off exfoliating honey peel off mask okay I don't like peel off masks because they hurt my face like, it hurts to take them off for some reason. I guess because of all, like, the baby hairs, maybe. And I'm not very, like, cautious around my eyebrows and around my hair. But I do like exfoliating type masks and things like that because I have very dry skin. So, I'm kind of excited about this, but yet yeah, a little bit scared. I do like that there's like no cleanup also. You don't have to like wash your face a bazillion times. Like you wash your face to put the mask on and then you wash the mask off. It's just like, oh my gosh, how much freaking washing on my face can I do? But with this, you can just peel it off, put it on, and then the skin feels nice. But this is a cool thing to send in the winter too, if it's the winter months for you. 
The next thing is a foundation primer by Laura Mercier. I mean, I have not tried this. Um, I don't think I've tried anything by her, actually. But this is a ginormous tube. I didn't, why does everything look so tiny on the camera thing? But this would literally last me 20 years. I just don't use that much. I guess I have a small face. And I just use it, like, usually on these areas. But, so... Looks like Mama's not going to be buying any primer anytime soon. But I heard this is very good, so I'm excited to try it. The next thing uh, is uh, uh, Malin and Goat's Mojito Lip Balm. Daily Protection Soothing Treatment Fatty Acid Absorption Technology. Oh, that sounds fancy. I'm going to put it on my lips. It's like a... What would you call it? Lip balm. It has a slight mint scent. Very faint. I don't know if most people will be able to smell it. But with my super senses, I can smell it. That feels nice. Mmm. I like that. It kind of, it's very silky. Very silky. I use a lot of lip balms and things like this, so that's how I know it's like, I like that a lot. Because there's like a lot of different textures. Sometimes they can be like really thick and, okay. Oh, this is the last thing. Um, this is Natural Mineral Coconut Eyeshadow by Pacifica. Never tried anything from Pacifica. This is really cute packaging. Now, if I can figure out how to open it. <laughs> okay, I'm not laughing anymore because I really can't. I don't want to rip the packaging. That's how weird I am. Uh, well, I'm never, just never going to use this product. <laughs> I really want to show you to my viewers. Okay. It's just a really long thing. I got it, I got it, guys. I got it. For those of you that didn't give up on me, thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Come out. Come out of your home. Okay, that is really tight packaging. Okay, the color is, yeah, it was stuck in there too. There's like a glob of that like sticky glue stuff on it. Okay, I thought I was going crazy there. Um, it's 100% vegan, cruelty-free, formulated FD and C color, without those, I mean, huh, parabens and petroleum. Is petroleum bad? Portion of proceeds support clean water, that's cool. Okay, so this is really cute. I like this packaging. Some people might not like it and think it's like cheap plastic packaging, but I really like it. And then the color is this, mm, like, champagne taupe shimmer. And I don't think... Oh, this is really pretty. But very subtle. Very subtle. But it would be really pretty to do a, like... Okay. Okay. You guys are just not going to be able to see it. Um, uh, let me get it over here. No. Okay. Well, it's not as... It's not even as... Like, this is a very subtle color to look at. But it's even more subtle... Um, on, but it's a very pretty shimmer. It would actually be a really pretty highlight on some certain skin tones. Like a really pretty highlight. And then for kind of a no makeup look, it could be really pretty. I'm just like playing with it now. It's very smooth. 
it can be a little bit chunky, but that's okay because I'm just I was using my fingers, so I probably pulled up a lot of it. But I wish you guys could see it, but it's just so subtle that it just turns into like shine. But just to let you know, the eyeliner is very smudge proof. I'm smudging it. It's very smudge proof. It looks very pretty with this shimmer. Um, and it is semi matte, I would say. So, all in all, these are not exactly my kind of products other than the lip balm, which I would not expect to get in an Ipsy bag. But I like the whole theme of the fresh kind of thing. And I'm kind of excited to try some of the things in here. So that's always kind of cool in an Ipsy bag. There's nothing that I'm like, ah, oh, I hate. And I actually think that I'll try most of these. I might give this away in a giveaway because I know a lot of people really love this. Um, and I'm just not like, I could, I don't care about primer. And I got that MAC Mineral Primer. So I'll probably be using that like crazy. Um, but... Not to say I don't like it, I, usually the things I like the most I put in giveaways. So, I think that this was a really good bag. And I would keep this bag, but I just know that my best friend would be obsessed with it. So, you know, I just give things away like that. So, it's a really cute bag, let's just put it that way. She's very particular about things, and I know that she'd love it, so... I give it two things, two thumbs up, and um, for 10 bucks, that ain't bad. So, I hope you guys are having a pain-free, stress-free day. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love you guys, and mwah!